Adam Grant, the Shogun, and Mary Ann, John from the Age of Batman. Question. How'd you get into DC? Uh, uh, DC comics. Broke through the window. Broke through the window? Uh, <laughs> I started out on uh, Team Titan. Yeah. Uh, a buddy of mine, Kevin Conrad, was the anchor over Tony Daniel, mm -hmm. and he was exiting out of comics. Mm -hmm. So I kind of just took over that spot. He suggested me to an editor because um, I'd been working in comics for quite a while before that. What inspired you to uh, get involved in comics? Um, I'd always I'd drawn ever since I was a kid, but I'd never, as as a, a high school kid or you know a kid in junior high, or whatever. I'd never really collected comics. I was a late bloomer, um, so. Once I started collecting them and I started getting information about the art, then I started getting interested in, in just the comic, uh, the, the art side of it. But I had never read them. Um, I think I picked up my first comic when I was like 18. Okay. <laughs> I was really, I was painting Happy Clouds before that. <laughs> So once I saw the process, I watched a show called um, How They Do That, and they mm -hmm. talked about how Spawn was created, mm -hmm. and I realized that this was a real job. I never knew what an anchor was, so, um, and then I just kind of applied myself from there, and that's what transitioned into it. So what's the typical work day for you? Um, well, before kids, mm -hmm. I could six, eight-hour day maybe. After kids, it's like 15 after a day. Um, it just depends on the page, really. Uh, every page is different, so I could I could get a page and it could go through it in three hours, or uh, be working for 12 hours. Um, um, when you're working with uh, Capullo, do you guys ever like email each other back and forth on how y'all want things to look, or is it just pretty much the feel of it and just go with it? No, with, with the, the nice thing about Greg is he doesn't really give me any direction. Mm -hmm. um, it's just all in the pencil. Uh, and and he, he doesn't draw in a way that everything's set in stone. He gives me my freedom. Mm -hmm. um, there's no direction on this line needs to be this thickness, you know, thick to thin. Um, it's just all sketched out all complete. But it's loose enough that I can do what I need to do with it and, and give him back something with, with some energy and texture and all those things that, that we like about ink. Um, do you have any other future projects come up after this arc? Um, I, no, I never want to leave that now. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I hope there is no future other project uh, other than Batman. I, I want to stay on this book. I told Greg that he should stay until he's about 103. Uh, so we'll see how many issues we can we can crank out. He's fast. He's like a train that just never slows down. So we'll see how many issues we can do.